Hello, welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason. This is your daily relaxation hypnosis session for stress, creaky chair, uh, anxiety, and panic attacks. Can't do much about the creaky chair because pop well, maybe lose some weight that would probably uh make it less creaky so i've been doing these videos for over a month now and i'm never really sure what to do next with them if i'm honest because there's lots of uh, different techniques and different hypnotic interventions when it comes to things like stress and anxiety, panic attacks. Um, and it would be easier if you were here with me because then I could do whatever I did to suit you specifically. I mean, that makes sense, doesn't it? So if uh, you had an issue in a specific situation then I could run through that situation with you because I can't do that individually and also um, if I was to focus on a specific event that might occur it may not suit you it may not be right for you it might even jolt you out of uh, the you know the state of relaxation so what I thought about doing today is rehearsing for the future. And this is something that I would do with a client. This is something that I have done with clients where after the, let's say therapy is done or the interventions being completed, we test it. We can't always test it here and now. Uh, for example, if it's a phobia or if it's a, um, a stressful event, they're going to be feeling calm because they're with me and I'm a relaxing person. So they're going to feel calm and relaxed with me. But if it's they've got an issue with horses for example or you know like i don't have access to a horse i can't just bring a horse into the room um therefore it's a case of using your imagination to rehearse a situation in the future and to test feeling relaxed and to practice feeling relaxed in that situation so that's what we're going to do today but you're the one who's going to choose the situation i'm pointing at you now you're the one so it's important really if you can to think about a situation now before we even start the session so that you've already got it in your mind and then you can um, go into that situation in your mind in the future and just notice how it feels different with this sense of comfort and relaxation in your body and in your mind I hope this makes sense so the first thing to do really is just for you to have that in your mind where you're going to be going into where you're going to be transporting yourself um, remembering at all times that you're safe and it is just your imagination so for example uh, in the case of panic attacks if there's something that uh, was caught maybe in the past as being a trigger 
for anxiety, stress or panic, then if you choose to go into that situation in your mind, I'd like you to remember that there's uh, a cord, you know, you're attached to me in a sense, okay, as a safety. So if it gets too much, you can just come back. You know, you're always holding on. You can hold on to my hand in your mind. Hold on to my hand, which reminds you that you're safe at all times. Okay? So that's what we're going to do. If it feels weird holding my hand, then of course you don't have to hold my hand. But, you know, it's in your mind anyway. We're not literally holding hands. But in your mind, you can hold my hand to have that safety of going into that environment, into that potentially emotional situation that maybe you've always in the past had problems with. So by, you know, and the thing is with the mind, the mind doesn't necessarily know the difference between a real event and an imagined real event so in the same sense as if someone's got a phobia for something let's say uh, spiders or whatever it might be that person can imagine a spider and it, they might still get exactly the same results as they would if the spider was actually in the room they get the same physical and emotional reactions because the mind doesn't really know any different because the mind is just waiting for you to let it know how to react how to respond it's waiting for you to basically tell it you know what's right and what's useful so I think it would be good for us to get into the relaxed state of calmness in your body and in your mind. And uh, so we'll do that remembering you've got this event that we're going to think about, but you're going to be holding my hand throughout. And uh, I know for some of you, just hearing my voice has already sent you into a, a sense of really deep relaxation naturally and easily and instantly you feel calm and just happy inside like a little um, a trigger has just triggered that that feel good sensation to spread through your body and into your mind and that's natural the more you watch these videos listen to my audios uh, the more of an impact they can have on your life in a positive transformational way leading you forward towards the kind of life that you wish to have more happiness more contentment more uh, flexibility more choices I mean, the choices are already there anyway but it's not a case of just having the choices it's knowing that you have the choices, being aware of the choices, having a bunch of choices in a cupboard so you can't see them and not knowing they're there is of no use to anyone. You need to open the cupboard up and get them out and be aware of those choices at all times. just as you're aware of 
my voice. You're aware of how you physically feel right now. Maybe you're aware of the calmness that has naturally spread through your body just instantly through listening to the words that and you know that feelings really can quickly change your mental states get transformed by how you physically feel calm and relaxed in your mind and your body these feelings just happen naturally but nevertheless I'm going to count down the body different parts just so you can feel more relaxed in preparation for stepping into the future and testing out how you feel in that situation in your mind when you feel completely relaxed and calm and safe holding my hand and I'm going to just start at the top of your head notice a relaxed feeling in the top of your head and as we go down your body that feeling is going to grow that feeling of comfort and relaxation is going to grow and expand and it's already started to grow and expand to your forehead and your eyes and you can just notice how your eyes feel as that feeling of comfort safety and relaxation spreads down to your jaw your mouth your tongue and your jaw and as that feeling of comfort increases and expands down to your throat your chest all the way down to your stomach and spreading round from your throat to the sides of your neck to the back of your neck relaxing each individual muscle in the back of your neck as that feeling of comfort increases and expands the safety spreading all the way down your upper back your middle back and your lower back also spreading across your shoulders all the way down your arms into your hands and fingers And that feeling of comfort, safety and relaxation is even stronger now as it moves down your hips, down your legs, into your feet and toes. And as I count down from 20 down to 1, your body and mind will become ten times more relaxed with each number. Twenty. 
relax. 19. Relax. 18. Relax. 17. Relax. 16. Relax. 15. Relax. 14. Relax. 13. Relax. 12. Relax. 11. Relax. 10. Relax. 9. Relax. 8. Relax. 7. Relax. 6. Relax. 5. Relax. 4. Relax. 3. Relax. Two. Relax. One. Relax. And now, with your body and your mind, feeling calm and relaxed and safe, I'd like you to just think of that time in the future, an event when you're going to really need this feeling of deep relaxation in your body and your mind that you are currently experiencing. When you've got that thought in your mind, I'd like you just to take my hand in your mind, taking my hand for safety and stepping into that event in your mind. And noticing as that event unfolds in your mind, notice how differently you feel. 
compare to how you used to feel when you thought about this thing happening. Just being aware of the comfort, calmness, relaxed feeling and that safety you have connected to me. And I'd like you to step out of that situation, become aware of your body and your mind and the feeling of comfort. And maybe that feeling of comfort is actually increased so you feel even calmer and even more relaxed than before I'd like you to think about another time in the future something that maybe you weren't looking forward to but now you can feel safe and comfortable to step into that that thought in your mind whilst holding my hand for safety and you can just play that scenario out in your mind experiencing those feelings of deep relaxation and calmness in your body and in your mind with that added safety of holding my hand the whole time and notice how different it feels for you Notice how much more in control you feel. Noticing that those choices that maybe you weren't aware of before are now there in front of you all the time, reminding you that you choose whatever it is that you do next you choose what you do next and you can come back getting back in touch with the sensation of your body that deep relaxation and also the calmness the stillness of your mind and also the sense of accomplishment of now knowing that those things that maybe you thought were going to be difficult in the past when you were looking forward into the future now you can see that having experienced being full of calmness relaxation and safety you'll be able to deal with so much more than you ever imagined possible in a calm, relaxed loose manner constantly being reminded that you have 
choices. Always you have choices. And you can choose to continue to experience these feelings of deep relaxation in your body and your mind for the rest of the day. That brings us to the end of this session. Remembering that every time you hear my voice or see my face on a video, you will instantly and naturally feel full of comfort and relaxation and naturally feel happy and naturally be open to possibilities that can transform your life. so that you have more happiness and you welcome more kindness more love into your life enjoy the rest of the day feeling wonderful